Three sneaky ways that influencers will try and scam you, part two. Every influencer has to be guilty of doing this. They only send you their best performing posts, reach and impression metrics in order to inflate their viewership numbers. And then they use these inflated stats to charge you their inflated prices and usually they get away with it. Now here's an example. Recently we wanted to work with this particular influencer and we asked them how many story views they were getting. They said they were getting 35,000 story views. But of course we wanted proof, we wanted to see a screenshot of how many views they were actually getting. Now here's the screenshot that they sent us. You can clearly see that they just arranged the screenshot by the best performing story posts in the last 14 days and they're simply referencing this one story post in the top left there. But in reality, their stories are only getting 20,000 story views as you can see in the bottom right there. So really they should command half the price that they're actually asking for. Now, understandably, influencers do this all the time. So what you need to do is make sure you're getting multiple screenshots of an influencer story to see what their real story count is and also ask them if you can get a story that's currently live so you can see how many views that's also received. Follow for part three.